livello di software. What about the software? Software is a strategic element for machines working in this sector. So for years we've opted for in-house development of a very powerful software which makes the most out of the engineering of Rautech machines. This software is compatible with most architecture CADs on the market. For example, CADWorks, SEMA, Dietrix, HSB CAD. They all have an option for exporting data to our software, which collects this data and programs the machine with just one click. So it is easy to go from the builder's or architect's design, selected by the end consumer, to the machine instructions. Precisely. What we did was to put all the know-how carpenters used to apply to do this work by hand into our software. Now all of this know-how is in our software, which is also updated with constant releases since know-how continues to grow. Our software improves over time in terms of capability to perform machining in increasingly shorter time and generally with better skill. And by facing aesthetic challenges, because a wooden house is no longer just a chalet, but more and more buildings are homes, which are part of a city with a nicer design and architecture. And so I guess your software is used for this as well. Exactly. And that's why it's an extremely flexible software. Obviously, the operator can add new specifications and new machining operations based on design from architects. And in general, we need to keep up to date with the changes in architectural techniques. This seems like a very important aspect which goes along with another current topic, eco-sustainability, green economy. Even machines for wood are required to make a bigger sacrifice and commitment both in terms of energy consumption and performance. Have you dealt with this issue with Oikos 12? It definitely was an aspect which guided us in developing the project. The machine has an extremely advanced electronic design. One of the most innovative characteristics in this sector is a function used to regenerate motor braking energy. So, thanks to this function, it is possible to lower machine energy consumption. Thus, a machine which consumes little to produce pieces for architecture which consumes little. Another feature of the software we developed is its simulation function. This function can be used in our customer's office to intervene upstream from any special machining operations which may occur during projects. This gives our customers a competitive edge. They can avoid problems which can occur on the machine interrupting the machining cycle on pieces with a significant unit value. This way, machining is as seamless as possible. So, when the piece is loaded in the machine, even a piece with a significant value, you can rest assured that everything will go ahead without problems and errors. Precisely, this is our goal and we think we've met it.